Hello and welcome to the Kinsey Art Review where we're going to cover an artist today by the name of Richard Blunt. You can catch him on Twitter at Blunt Art. Now he hails out of Cardiff and the West Midlands and this must be something about these South Walian artists or people who come from that area. Just superb, superb artist and just look at his work. I mean he's got a great following. He's uh, represented by a couple of galleries. One of them is the Washington Green Team so you can catch him in all the mainstream galleries. But it's just the way he captures life and he captures a bygone era by the way uh, you know if you look at um just just look at this painting of the couple by the world it's a uh, type uh, um uh and it's just a, just the way it all comes together it's just it's just beautiful i mean it just captures that bygone age you know you just a couple looking out to see the guy's always wearing his hat that's the trademark you've got the trill beyond uh, and you've got the you know the the glamour of that era, the passion of that era. There's there's a couple now coming up, which are all part of a dance, and it's almost that Latin American Havana type uh, environment. And you can see them them together here in a clinch. And as we move into the next painting now, you can see this part of this dance with the he's holding the the lady's leg, and it's just great the way he captures that mood and that that impression of it. And then as, as you're looking at his paintings, and you need to check them out because he's got lots of these paintings, you know, occasionally he comes together with one of these and it's, a, you know, a chalk, uh, a chalk painting, chalk drawing of a woman. But it's all about the bygone era. It's all, you know, throwing you back to the 20s, the 30s of when there was a certain amount of glamour involved in it. And here's another one in the series of the dancers. You know, you see the couple, the guy playing the guitar in the background, the couple dancing together. You can feel the movement, you can feel the intensity, you can feel uh, the raw emotion. And it, it is, the style is all about creating something that is that throwback um, to that era. And it just works wonderfully well. And that's, I guess that's why he's so successful with what he does. You know, and this chalk drawing that he's done here, you know, trademark Trilby, the guy playing the guitar with the trademark Trilby. You could spot one of his paintings a mile off because he has this trademark image in it. And it's just the detail, the fine detail of what he does and, and creating that image of the past. Of, I mean, you know, that probably really didn't exist, but you just believe it exists when you look at his paintings, you know, on the seafront at the railings, looking out to the sea, you know, he's taking his jacket off, he's wrapped it around his lady, it's that, that whole emotion, walking back from the sea up to up the beach, you know, he's got the pier in the background, it is that 1920s, 1930s, just kind of slick, so it kind of feel to um to the paintings and once again on the sea out for a day out you know you notice they're not in the bathers the there was a dress code at the time and he's captured that he's captured the feel of that and the romance of it that's the word i'm looking for it's the romance of the period it's the romance of what it all uh, stood for you know we've got a beautiful sunset looking over over the sea here of the couple uh looking from the headland out into it and it is it's romanticising a period in time that was just full of exuberance and charm. Uh, and this one, when they're, they're sat there with the champagne glasses, he's got his trilby on, she's in the trademark red dress. Just beautiful the way it's put together. So it's no wonder he's um, a you know, well-respected artist and people follow him. Uh, as I say, you can catch him at uh, Blunt Art on Twitter and go into any of the Washington Green uh, big art shops and you'll see some of his paintings there. Thanks for listening and watching.